Okay guys, so this is another request a video from one of my ladies on Facebook. I'm not gonna put her real name out there. I don't know if I'm not sure if she wants her name out there, but this is for you mama, so I hope you really enjoy this. I'm gonna make yellow rice with red beans. Um, and I also make this exact the same as gandules. I just add different kind of beans like white beans, black beans, pink beans, red beans, whatever kind of beans you want to put in here. So, but I will little by little share with you guys different ways of yellow rice that I make. So, this is going to be yellow rice, red beans. I start off with the oil and you can use whatever oil you prefer. Olive oil, corn oil, vegetable oil, whatever oil. As always, I only put a little bit in there just to coat the bottom. I'm going to use a whole can of red beans after I rinsed them and took the juice out of it. I'm also going to use sofrito, which would be one, two spoons. Also going to add a little bit of garlic, um, a pack of sassoon, and I always get the one with achote, okay? It's always the one with achote. Um, some adobo. Like I said, I don't measure, but I go around a couple times and that's it. Some black pepper. A whole can of tomato sauce. And I'm gonna also be using, I always put pentimientos in my rice. It's just, I was raised that way. I always use it and love it. But this is optional. You don't have to put pentimientos if you don't have it or don't like it or whatever the case may be. It'd be like a chunk like this. And I just basically just rip it into little, little chunks. Okay. Then I'm gonna let this saute. I'm gonna saute the beans for like two minutes on medium heat. And I'm gonna bring that to a boil. And then I'm gonna add my rice. All right, guys. So as you see, I brought it to a boil. Um, the beans are nice and saute now. So now I'm gonna add my rice. I'm gonna add. Four cups of rice depending on how many people you have in your house or you're cooking for is depending on how much rice you're gonna cook and how many cups for me I always use four cups of rice which will serve my whole family so yeah so let's go ahead and add the rice I have already cleaned it and rinsed it now let me add some water That's enough of water, just right above the rice. That's how much water you're gonna put. Not too much, cause you don't want this to come out sticky. And I'm gonna just stir it here really, really good. And then I'm gonna let it cook. Okay guys, so once you see your rice looking like this, where you can no longer see the water, this is where you want to turn it okay so I'm gonna put the flame on low about a three and I'm gonna turn it so you want to flip the rice from the bottom over okay
once I turn it I'm gonna cover it and I'm gonna let it simmer for about a half hour and I'm um, gonna leave it on low heat let it simmer do not open this until it is done because then you'll take the simmer out of it and it will be hard to cook after that so do not open this leave it like this for about half hour let it cook on low and then yeah you're done so I'll show you a picture once it's done thanks for watching guys and as always thanks for all the requests and all the support and I'll talk to you soon bye alright guys so the rice has been cooking for about 45 minutes and I'm gonna turn it just one more time I have not turned it since it was boiling so let me go ahead and turn it one more time this is the last time and I will not touch I will not one more time I'm gonna turn it and after that I will not touch it again um, until dinner time so let me go ahead and open steamy it is done the rice is nice and soft I can tell just by the look of the rice um, you can tell when the rice is a little bit raw it looks like white and this is nice and soft